what is up YouTube, I am Stargify, and today I'm going to be showing you guys some armor I made for a uh, shoulder, or it's just one piece of armor, but it's for my Assassin's Creed costume. Um, this is Simpson Strong Tides, you can get them at Lowe's for like a dollar a piece, it's not that bad. But um, yeah, it's uh, pretty strong, um, basically, uh, I'll pick it up for you guys and then I'll show you on my costume. But uh, it holds together fairly well, um, if you guys are wondering how to do it. Uh, you take some string, uh, obviously you should probably use something more fancy than I had. I didn't have leather strips, but that's what I plan on using whenever I do get it. Um, you start way up here, you guys can see the knot right there. I started, I uh, crisscrossed all the way down, then all the way back, and then uh, from the bottom, I went on that side, and in the middle, and it wasn't too hard. It is time consuming, but um, you gotta have a decent amount of patience. So, yeah, so this will protect your shoulder. Um, this is some type of steel. It's pretty thick, but uh, I'm not going to try it out against blocking a sword. But um, yeah, I'm sure I'm sure it blocks something fairly well. But if I show you guys on my Assassin's Creed costume, I'm going to have to hold it or else it'll fall. But um, you guys can see it like that. Uh, I'd like to show you guys from far away, but it's going to fall if I do. It's not finished. I'm going to get some leather and place it on the uh, back side of it, and I'm going to rivet in with those holes right there. And from there, it'll sort of look like that piece, and it will have a belt that comes from there all the way down. And then it should hold on fairly well. Um, whenever I hold this on my shoulder, it, uh, it stays up pretty well. It's not too bad, but um, yeah, I mean, it's really easy to make if you guys have been looking to make some uh, replica armor, I guess. I mean, it's got some giant holes in it, but if you put leather underneath it, it'll sort of add to it, I guess. Because it would just sort of show through and then, you know, gives a little bit of color. But, um, yeah, I mean, it holds together fairly well. Um, get straightened back out. But, I would, like I said, do not use string. Um, obviously, it's not going to be most sturdy, but it's all I had, so you can't blame me for trying. But, um, yeah, so it's not that bad. But um, I've seen some people make, I actually got the idea on the internet. I saw someone make the shoulder pieces, a full chest piece. It looked really cool. I wasn't that dedicated, nor did I have the money, so I, all I needed is a sh uh, uh, shoulder piece, and uh, that's what I made. I should probably bend some of these pieces back in, but it's really easy. Just I bent these on my leg, and then it fits fairly well. And uh, yeah, so if you guys want to make it, definitely try it out. It's a cool little project to do. I'll show you guys the back side. It's sort of what it looks like from the back side. If it's bent, I guess. But um, like I said, the threading for it's terrible, so don't judge me to that but um yeah hope you guys enjoyed and definitely try this out whenever you guys have uh some spare money and just want to make something weird but so uh, yeah i'll see you guys next time